Today we're going to draw a seahorse. Okay, I am going to draw a seahorse. Okay, I'm just going to put in, see I've just sort of done a few lines there. So I'll find how I start. And then I will stick in some of these lines. And that's making the shape of the body. See, I'm just sort of maybe just going on the outside a bit. I might curve the tail a bit more than this here. You can see I very quickly just worked out the outside edge. Now, let's have a look at him here. His eye. And he's got these little spikes coming up like that. He's very spiky, this guy, which is really cool. More guidelines here. So I've just sort of marked out the high points just lightly in pencil, but now what I'm going to do is just shade in these. So I'm going to go in a bit darker there, just leaving. High points a lighter colour. So you see I'm almost making it like a staple shape. And I'm just shading the top part. And here's like upside down L's. Here's a narrower version of that staple shape. Now this comes up like that. And here we've got these wonderful jagged sort of lines like this. that shape there right. Cuts in like that. A few more spikes. It's an old lower mouth. He's got some little stripes here like this. Now I'm really enjoying the spikes on this guy. So each of these high points I'm going to put a little bit of a spike. Because I think it looks cool. Just like before, very gently marking out some stuff and I might pop A bit of weed there. A serrated end, just like a bit of kelp leaf. Kelp has this sort of wrinkly texture like that. Getting sort of little stapley shapes here. See, so I've made like a little box. Again, this guy is very spiky, which is really cool. See here where the tail goes there, I'm going to make the weed really dark underneath that little spot there. Wiggly line there. I'm going to 
chucking the weed up there just so it hopefully makes the seahorse come forward. Probably needs another leaf here. So it's not just straight lines, it's sort of like like you're going for a straight line then you skip a bit and then you put another one in. Give me that wrinkly seaweed look. I'll show you that in there. Dark in there. And again, a few stripes here. Just outline some of these a bit more. There's our seahorse. Hope you guys enjoyed that how to draw a seahorse video. If you want to check out another how to draw, here's how to draw a shark. Or if you want to see me play with some live snakes, here's some live snake videos. And check out my channel. You know, have a look at some of my other videos and maybe subscribe. See you later.